much better with butter. Jeez, I told the expert kids to eat this, Mum. Makes <laughs> Hello and welcome back to my channel. So, as you would have seen by today's title on the video, I'm going to be eating Halloween treats for 24 hours. Another 24 hour challenge. Did one in the past where I ate like a child for 24 hours. It was great. A really good excuse to just eat shit. And it's another great excuse to eat shit again. As you already know, I am a personal trainer. As you already know, I am on my own fitness journey. So, this video is gonna be a nice little break, a nice little treat. So yeah, I've not long just woke up, it is 10 past eight in the morning, so I am due my breakfast. Normally I would have like porridge or bran flakes, but with this being a Halloween treats 24 hour challenge, I'm gonna sort now. Got a bunch of treats, I've got chocolates, sweets, uh, savory snacks, um, so I'm just gonna get started. Sort the challenge off and yeah. Sorry for the husky voice. I need to wake up properly. So tonight I um I've got no clients this morning, which is great. It's the only day that I don't have clients in the morning. And um I've got my nine to five job and then six till ten PM I'm at PR Gym, so I've got a couple of classes, so fingers crossed I'm gonna be not feeling too shit for them, but we'll see. But it is what it is. This is a challenge, so let's get into it and just take advantage of it because I know we're gonna get the skin. So yeah, let's go. So I've got a big, massive bag of treats, full of chocolate, full of sweets. So let's get straight into it and have some breakfast. So I've got more stuff in the bag. There's loads of stuff in the. But I picked this up, right? I'm not even lying. This was one pound, right? Because you know the little plastic things that you used to get back in the day, the pumpkins and stuff like that. Six pound it was. Six pound. I was not paying that. So this little crappy paper thing with cob with this string to sort of pick this one up. But life is getting expensive, man. But yeah, I just thought this was cool. It's got like little bats and ghosts on and stuff like that. Spooky! <gasps> so I picked up these. These are serene. You know I love a good serene. Um, I think I made the mistake last time when I did the... What challenge do I do? It was something that I picked up when it, it was serene. And didn't end up putting any butter with it. So um, I think that was my first mistake, it was very stodgy, but I'm going to put some butter over these today. Um, these are cherry jellies, 5 milli loaves, and yeah, instead of serene, it's got scream. A bit of Halloween mug in there for you. But yeah, judging by the photo, it looked really nice. So, first meal of the day, enjoy the mood. So guys, this is the serene. Put some butter with it. I see some. It looks like I've absolutely jam packed it. Uh, but yeah, they are quite stodgy, and I've only put it on top. So it's what they look like. Let's taste them. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Much better with butter. Much better with butter. Mm. I'm going to be eating quite a lot today, so yeah, I just want to just have three. But yeah, this is what they look like inside. You can see the cherry in them. Absolutely unreal. Highly recommend these, and they're so tasty. The cherry comes through straight away. Unreal. I've got my little morning coffee, 20 grams of protein, my serene, and I'm just about to log in to work. 8.51, I start work, nine o'clock, and then six o'clock at night, I'm going to the gym, work until 10 o'clock, so that's gonna be my day to day. But yeah, what a lovely start.
So, und mein Fenster auf. So, und mein Fenster auf in dem Probe, die Wasche da haben wir vielleicht. So, ich will jetzt auch so ein Schokolade, so ein Alter. Ich stehe jetzt schon die Lappe auf, die Lee. Ich kann mir nicht so abtun, die Ecke. So. Ja. Look forward to it. Got me a nice little setup this morning. Let me candles. I'm watching Angel at the minute. I've watched Charmed, I've watched Buffy, now I'm on Angel. Season 3, episode 5, so I've literally got a couple of seasons left. I don't know what I'm going to watch after, but uh, yeah. And oh look, there, it was my birthday the other day. Little balloons left over. So yeah. Nice little setup. So it's about half nine now. I'm feeling a little bit peckish, so I thought let's just get some snacks. So I'm gonna get my bag full of goodies. Ah, what should I have? So many things in here. Ooh, I don't know. So, I picked these up. These are the Reese's peanut butter skeletons, chocolate candy, and peanut butter cream. So, yeah. Let's get stuck into these. Oh, they're like little. Didn't expect them to look like that. They're like little mini skeleton things. Also, sorry for the nasally sort of like sore throat. I think I'm coming down with something. It's going about and like weather's changed and stuff like that. So yeah, uh, and there's a big massive spike in COVID. So I'm going to have to test for that, which is brilliant. So yeah, these are the little Reese's peanut butter things. Look how cool they are, man. Little skeletons. Oh, there's a vampire. So they have like different skeleton pirate. Little vampire. Another vampire, I think they're just vampires and pirates. So yeah, let's crack one open. So that's what they look like. Mmm. Wow. Look at that one. I absolutely love Reese's peanut butter cups. I can literally go through Cup upon cup upon cup, absolutely unreal. Can't get enough. So these, these are dangerous because they're small and there's a big massive bag of them. So yeah, I'm gonna have a couple of them. Oh, today is a good day, man. Peanut butter. You can't go wrong with peanut butter. It's protein. Good fats and a little bit of chocolate around. Can of go on. Mm. So we've got like little pictures on the back here. A skeleton of fun. <laughs> I laugh if I had a tongue. I laugh if I had a tongue. I don't get that one. No, I don't get that one. That one makes no sense whatsoever. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna munch on these. Gonna have a couple, and yeah, a nice little morning snack. I uh, will probably snack way before lunch again. Um, I'll probably have some other stuff. The sweets, crisps, biscuits. But yeah, how can you get up? Get in the shower because I've got my pajamas on. And yeah, I've not even done my hair, not washed or brushed my teeth yet. And it's like nine, half nine. But yeah, so far it's just a nice slow morning. Um absolutely loving it. So yeah. Morning snack. No 
I'm gonna have to stop soon because I'm literally just eating one after the other, one after the other. It's really addictive. Anyone who's had Reese's before will know what I'm all about. They are so addictive. There's definitely something in them that just makes you want to eat them more and more and more. So yeah, very dangerous, but absolutely unreal. Um, it is now 11.32. Have I been in the shower and made myself presentable? No. Have I brushed my teeth? No. I'm basically feeling a little bit peckish. I've just made myself a lovely cup of tea, which I don't actually get to have these days because I'm working so much. Um, I only have like coffee in the morning and then obviously I'm working at 10 o'clock at night and I don't necessarily want to be drinking caffeine at night because it's hard for us to settle down anyway. So what I started doing is I'll have like a chocolate Horlicks, which is just an absolute game changer. It's got all your vitamins in and it's just really good for like settling down. And I found a really big difference at night um, with just drinking Horlicks because when I drink a cup of teas, I was just getting a little bit of a height. I think the caffeine was just starting to kick in and I'll just have a crap night's sleep. Anyway, little backstory for you, which you probably didn't ask for and has no relevance to this video, but I told you anyway. Anyway, I've made a nice cup of tea, so it's going to be a nice change. I'm going to have these Oreo vanilla flavour spooky biscuits. Now, I am not that much of a fan of um, Oreo. It's just not a biscuit that I necessarily go for. Because it was Halloween themed, uh, I just sort of picked them up because I couldn't really say anything else um, biscuit wise that was like Halloween themed. So I picked them up and hopefully they're going to taste nice. So I'll let you know. Maybe you should have got note with these, but nah. I'm going to dip some in a cup of tea and yeah, see what they taste like. They look are we? So yeah, let's have a go. Mmm, smell unreal. I don't know why I'm not a fan of Oreos, because they literally do smell unreal. Oh. So yeah, that's what they look like. We've got the little Oreo on there, and then when you turn it around, as you can see, Nice little scary face there. Mmm. <gasps> they taste unreal. And the flavouring is vanilla. But the inside is like orange. Orange and black. Going for the Halloween theme. Are Oreo normally vanilla flavour? Like, what is the taste of Oreos? Mmm. They taste really nice, actually. Have it with a bare cup of tea. Lovely. This is where I literally, this is where I literally go through the whole packet. It's so hard, right? Do you know what I just can't comprehend? It takes about an hour, or half an hour, half an hour to an hour, depending on the speed you go, the incline, but it takes about that time to burn off one custard cream, which is 60 calories. But I could go through a double pack of custard creams like that and not even think about it. And it's just a shame that in life, you can do that. Oh, they've all got different like faces. Look at that one. You see that? And then the next one would be different. Oh, same as the first one. Yeah. It's a hard road for you to eat the things that you love and not get into it. I honestly wish, I honestly wish I was like 16 again. Come back, I used to come back from school and I used to literally have kebabs, 
for dinner every night. I used to have Doritos. What are they? Doritos. I used to cut up blocks, blocks of cheese, chili Doritos, go through a whole bag of chili Doritos, one after the other with a bit of cheese, and then used to have chocolate, sweets, you name it, biscuits, and never used to touch it. By the time I was like 20, 21, 22, that's when I started, like, that's when the food started hitting. I started bulking out, started putting weight on, got a belly, because I was going out drinking as well. Um, yeah, it just wasn't a good, it wasn't a good mix, but they do say, they do say, it'll hit you one day, and honestly, let us tell you, it does. But today of all days, we're having a break. Another one, thank you. Also, I forgot to show you this. New tattoo. It's a charmed triquetra. Done by Jimmy at Studio One. Absolutely kills the whole time. And then I've got, uh, I don't know if you can see, but I've got a Libra sign behind me here as well, which is what I've always wanted. So, yeah. Little additions uh, to the tattoo family. I don't know what I'm going to go through next. Um, I want to start like doing stamp tattoos on my own, where the triquetra is, and I want the angel in the north, just to let you know. Show me roots off. Not that I've ever been to the angel in the north, like, I need to go, I tell you what, I need to go to the angel in the north before I get the angel in the north tattoo, because that's just, yeah, I can't believe I lived in Newcastle all those years and not visited the biggest landmark of Newcastle, which is the Angel North. It's just crazy. I'm going to crack on with these biscuits. Hopefully, I can make myself stop. But uh, yeah, we'll see. I'm already half a bar down. So they're just so tasty. I didn't expect these to taste so nice. Like, it's vanilla, the normal flavour for Oreos. How many is in each one? Per two biscuits is 104 calories. That's nothing that is. So it's like 50, 50 calories per... 50 calories per biscuit, which isn't too bad. Less than a custard cream. <sighs> right, so I'm gonna enjoy a cup of tea, eat some more biscuits, and I think next will be lunch. So it'll be interesting to see what I can choose for my lunch, because already... Already I feel myself getting a little bit sickly. So, yeah, it'd be interesting to see what concoction I have to make to kind of make a normal lunch, but we'll see. Okay, so it is now around half one. I'm basically going to have some lunch. When I say lunch, I mean more treats. I've managed to get in the shower, freshen myself up, stuck some actual clothes on, and yeah, I do feel a lot better for it. But, uh I just woke up the season now, but... Yeah, I'm definitely coming down with something because everything's taking my breath away. And these are all sounding like COVID symptoms, which is just absolutely amazing. I cannot afford to have any time off work. So yeah, push through. Anyway, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put my lunch together and I have no idea what I'm gonna have. Uh, so I'm just gonna have a look at the stuff I've got and see what I fancy. Let's go. Uh, I've got some salt and vinegar batten webs, which just sort of vinegar crisps. I've got some mummy mix sweets, so I'll probably stick some of them in. And Jaffa Wien cakes, which are cake balls, but they've actually got cherry flavour in. I don't, what is it about? I think because it's meant to resemble blood or something like that. Cherry, because I've seen a lot of cherry stuff. And then, I know it's not Halloween, but it kind of is. This is kind of stuff that you pick up around Halloween. For like people not knowing you doing stuff like that. So it's like the fun size family favourites. It's got your Snickers, your Milky Way, your bars, your bars, your Mars, and your Twixes. So you get 20 bars in here. It says approximately. You're not counting. Uh, so yeah, that's him. Got some more things, but I kind of want to like save it for later on because I kind of just don't want to be eating the same stuff all day, if that makes sense. So yeah, see what we can make out of what we've got. So I'm just gonna put myself a little plate. So there's me chips. 
Look how cool they look, man. Like bots, webs, and the smoke unreal. Um, I love a couple of drumsticks. Uh, is in there. Love hearts. Good for them. Where are the lollies? There's no lollies in here, which is a bit shit. Oh, I'll switch out a drumstick for a tinga. Stinger. Stinger? Stinger. And then, oat knees and a Milky Way. Ooh, Snickers. The Snickers? Oh, yes, Snickers. Right. So, yeah, guys, that is my lunch for today. Looks very tasty, very sweet. So, yeah, let's go for it. So, bon appetit. I'm gonna try the Halloween Jaffa cake for see what that tastes like. Mmm. Mmm. That's really nice, that is. I love good Jaffa cake. Question Is it a biscuit? Or is it a cake? Comments. Put it in the comments below. Let us know. My opinion. It's a cake. It's a cake. There's nothing biscuity about it. Biscuits are hard. Mmm. They're lovely then, you know. She should bring out more flavours more often for chocolate cakes because the cherry flavour is really nice just kind of like changes it up and it's only 97 calories per bowl so you wouldn't really what a meal to have man what a meal to have I don't think I would crave normal food so much at this point I thought I would be like I thought I would last longer I think it's getting a little bit sickly now having all this sweet stuff but there was just not like any savoury like the only savoury things that I could come across was these crisps and that was it, the rest was sweets which makes sense because it's Halloween but you know what I mean I don't know it is a hard man take your teeth out Jeez, I totally expect kids to eat this, Mum. It's gonna rip out our teeth. If I'm craving normal food at lunch, by the end of the day, I'm gonna be struggling, especially for me dinner. But, I'm not complaining. Sweets are sweets, and that's some love hearts. See what they say. Share love. Your love. Ever yours. My hero. Share love. You and I. My angel. Love Maltese does. Just can't go wrong. I'm trying to think of what I could update you on. So like all I've been doing since I started the gym is working. Like I said, sometimes I work from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. at night. Back to back clients. Normal job with Green King. Um um them starting the gym and then I took an extra shift on as well so normally I do Tuesday, Wednesday and Sunday but I took on an extra shift because they're a bit short stuff so I did I do Mondays now but you know it's all for a good cause 
Mm. These are nice cheese. They taste like, um, do you know the twister things that you get? The sort of thing that twists. Also, when this video goes up, I have got another video planned for next week. So stay tuned because my next video is with my sister-in-law. We're going to be putting Halloween makeup on each other. I don't know what I'm going to do with her yet. She's going to put makeup on me. I'm going to put makeup on her. And we're basically just going to see how it goes. I mean, I'm not a makeup artist, so it's probably going to go terrible, but you know, God loves a try. I'm kind of like thinking like maybe I can't say it because she might watch this, so yeah, I've got a couple of ideas, I kind of know what I'm going to go for, but yeah, Halloween, I like it, I like the autumnal vibes, I like the, cost, like, I like the costumes and stuff like that, but when it comes to horror, when it comes to scary stuff, scary costumes, not just like kids dressing up as like, you know, cats or whatever, when it comes to like blood, really 100% scary costumes, I'm out. Um, like I say, can't deal with horrors, can't deal with jumping, uh, suspense, absolutely hate it. Thrillers, I, basically, I, I don't even like the comedy going downhill. So, <clears throat> so yeah, it's just not for me. It was my sister-in-law's birthday um, last week, and she wants to go to the cinema to watch a horror. And I point blank said, no, I'm not going. So they're all going tonight. Uh, I'm working anyway, so it kind of works out well, but I would have literally, I would have point back refused. I'm not going to the cinema to watch a horror where I feel like I can't leave and I'm going to put myself through that. No, no chance in hell. The point is, this lunch hasn't actually been that bad. I enjoyed it. Oh, fucking hell. What are the putting in these? They're meant to be chewable, aren't they? I love a drumstick. Drumsticks just never get old, do they? Just got me snickers to eat, and I'm done. But overall, that was actually really nice. Fucking hell, look at the size of that, man. They're taking the piss there. That is like, there's mini and then there's that. Mmm. Snickers are underrated, man. I need to invest in these more often. Instead of going for like bars of chocolate, like Cadbury and stuff like that. I need to start picking these up because they're just unreal. Mm, 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 mm. Right. Probably maybe two, three o'clock. I might have a snack. So I'll check in with you then. And yeah. Let's see what we've got for a snack. Guys, call me a okay. kid. I'm literally sat here watching Pokemon. Absolutely love it. It's my childhood, man. I'm just sitting, chilling, eating crisps. Can't get enough of these. Pop out of the Yeah, I'm just working on my laptop, watching TV, and snacking. This is a lie. Hold on tight. So it is now 3.26. I'm feeling a little bit peckish, so what I've decided I'm gonna have is some Cadbury pumpkin patch cakes. Now how unreal to be a nice little chocolate cake with, I'm guessing, white chocolate in the middle. But yeah, gonna cut these open. You get four in a pack, let's go. Ooh. These look all dry. So that's what one looks like. Mmm. Wow. 
Wow, wow, wow. That's the inside. It's got like a little orange. I think it's vanilla. I'm sure it's vanilla. But it's like a creamy filling. Mmm. Mm. It's lovely, don't get us wrong. I'm really enjoying it. I don't get us wrong. But I just want like some chicken or rice or like just some it not sweet. I'm just, I, I think I am struggling a little bit now like <sighs> but I'm hungry so you know it is what it is. The whole part of the time. Mm. And these are cool just like Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to save them two for maybe later. Oh, God, we've got so much stuff. So much stuff to go through. I need a drink or something. I've been drinking water. And I think I'm going to have to get another glass. Because that was really sickly. <laughs> oh. It's getting, it's getting, I'm starting to show them now, like, I'm probably going to get hungry again, so I'm going to have another snack, and then it'll be dinner time, I'll probably be at the gym by the time I have my dinner, so yeah, a little bit of a change of scenery, uh, I don't, uh, when I think about dinner, I honestly, I'm like, struggling, I don't, I don't know what I'm going to have. I've got to do classes as well, man. So, guys, it is around 4 30, so um, nearly the end of the day for the Green King job, nearly the start of the Pure Gym job. But I'm sitting here just working away, watching a bit of TV, and I'm just getting a little bit peckish. So, I've basically stuck all the sweets in here. Take a little pick a mix in it, so I'm just gonna, you know, blindly pick things out and just snack on a couple of things because there's nothing in here that I don't like. But yeah, more sweets. Uh, I thought I'd sit my glasses on because my eyes are a little bit sore. So yeah, I need to watch the TV with them and with my computer, so I thought I'd sit them on. But what do you think? I want to spec see was. I've had them for a while. And they're still doing wonders, so yeah. Look a little bit like Harry Potter, but you know, looks good. Hello, so guys, I am at the gym now. Um, I've just done my classes, both of them. So it's now 8.27. So it's been dinner time. When it's, honestly, when I say dinner time, it's probably gonna be the same shit that I had for lunch. It's gonna have to be, um, cause yeah, this challenge and all. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, plate it up and I'll show you what I've got. Cause that last time I ate it was like, uh, four or five o'clock wasn't it so I'm glad I had I've had like a good two to three hours break so like I was a bit sick of eating the sweet stuff because I was eating like every so often but now that I've had a good break um, I'm actually craving a little bit of sweet now so yeah it's uh, it's done as a favour and especially because I've just done the classes and exercise and stuff like that I'm even more hungry mmm lovely lovely I've got these these are the Haribo monsters uh, it's Halloween Monster approved, apparently, and the Happy World of Haribo, and it's Zing. I think they are maybe sour. So you get Beastly Blackcurrant, which is the bot, Ghoulish Apple, which is the green ones, and Blood Orange Teeth, 
which is strawberry I think oh no blood orange that would make sense it's orange this is quite the dinner this is Maltesers a little Jaffa cake uh, cake and a Twix and I think there's a Snickers in there Snickers and these balls they're like eyeballs so like chocolate flavour I think milk chocolate pop ooh pop and candy didn't realize what pop and candy eyeballs so these are Sainsbury's own makes these so I'll stick a couple of eyes on there look mmm so I'll best get tucked in mmm My uncle is throbbing. But then how you both things are lush. Nice and sour. I think that's meant to be Frankenstein. And these are the teeth. I'm gonna try these eyeballs. So that's what they look like look. Oh! Anyway, you get the gist. Mmm. Did not expect it to look like that. I thought it was just going to be solid chocolate. But I think it's got white chocolate inside. Mmm. They're good, them like. Mm. Yeah. Can you have it? <sighs> bon appetit, eh? I'm absolutely knocked after those. My uncle's still hurting. That's going to kill the morning now. I'm not looking forward to that. And also, I've got to walk around this tree and clean it, put away the weights. I'm going to be hobbling all over the place. If you're wondering, uh, today's classes I did a sweat 45, which is like cardio based exercises. And then I did a mind class where you do like yoga stretching and then I'll do like a I kinda like switch it up and do a little bit I do like a little bit of mindfulness at the end. Um so yeah. Both of them went really really well. I always got loads of people come which is kind of like you kinda of expect it because it's obviously evening time everyone's finished work so it's probably the busiest time for people to come to their classes. But everyone seems to join them. I'll get a good feedback so. though. There's got to be like a little bit of protein in here, isn't there? There's protein in everything. I mean, Snickers, nuts. Uh, I think that's it. Is there protein in the sweets? Oh, fuck knows. I don't know. What, right, so what other challenge could I do other than eating? If anyone's got any like ideas of what I could do next for a 24 hour challenge, let us know. Because I like doing them. I like setting myself a challenge. Uh, 
I didn't think I was gonna get this lot to be honest. But I did it. I'm not even joking here, like. I think I'm gonna have to leave it there. I can't do it anymore. I've done well, I think. I need some put off food. Alright, I'm gonna done I'm gonna be done with this, right? I've got a couple more snacks, so like maybe in a couple of hours I'll come back, eat some snacks. I'm still eating. I'm still eating it. Still eating it. Fuck no. Right, I'm going to put it away. That did well though, considering how much I put on there. I made quite a lot. I just can't do it anymore. I'm getting too full. I'm still eating it. Right. I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to get it away. Right, I'll come back. Out of 10, right? So I'm feeling a little bit peckish. Last bit of the snacks that I've got is this Dracula milk chocolate lolly, and then these Sainsbury sweets, which is Guess the Ghosts, four mysterious flavors inside. Can you guess each flavor? Guessing flavors are cola, watermelon, orange, and raspberry. So I thought I'd walk these open. They look like little scream mosques there. Eh? See what it tastes like. Cola maybe? I think that was cola. Right, let's see what this one is. Watermelon. Let's see if I can get all four flavours. I think that was watermelon again. Watermelon again. I think that one was raspberry. If anyone's watching this video and they're still doing Halloween sweets in Sainsbury's, honestly, go pick these up. They're proper tasty. I thought they were going to be like, um, do you know their milky bottles that you get? Can I pick them up? Look at that, Mum. I'm going to suck your blood. It's a nice little milky lolly. Mm. Tastes sour, just milk chocolate. All in one. So guys, the camera died, so um, yeah, didn't get any content for you at the gym, but practically that was it. But I am now in bed, thank God, it's like half ten, so I've got me, oh, ow, I've just fucking swirled myself, that's it. Uh, I've got me Horlux, so I'm settling down for tonight. And then, got my candles on. Got my candles on. I'm just going to stick some Netflix on and then literally just have a couple of bits in here. I think tonight I'm going to have a Milky Way and I hope to God there's another Snickers in here. I'm going to have some Reese's bits. I want the Snickers. Oh, I'll have to go hunting for it. But I'm literally just gonna have me Horlix, have some snacks. I don't know how I'm doing this after all the shit I've ate today, but I'm still craving sweet stuff. So yeah, here we would have thought. But I'm just gonna finish the video there because I'll be honest guys, I'm not gonna wake up tomorrow and eat shit. I need to eat normal food. I can't do this any longer. Like, I don't think I could wake up tomorrow and eat another piece of chocolate or sweets. I need to have proper food. But it's been a really good, fun challenge to do. 
that is the end of today's video. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Like I said before, if you've got any other ideas of 24 hour challenges that you'd like us to do or that you'd like to see on the channel um, and you think that would be good art, definitely drop them in the comments below. I'll give them a good go. Um, and I'm going to have a think myself and see which ones are kind of fancy. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment and share. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. There's a lot more content coming, a lot more challenges, hair tutorials, vlogs, fitness videos, you name it. My niche is all over the place. I don't stick to one thing. I will see you next week for another video. Cheers.